animals in the ocean aren't evenly spread out like the cheese on a pizza. Instead, they often group together to create dynamic patches of life. Such aggregations can increase an animal's chances of staying safe, finding food, or meeting a mate in the vast ocean. These schooling lanternfish use the safety in numbers idea to protect themselves from attacking Humboldt squid. By visually confusing their predators, they increase their chances of survival. However, Humboldt squid are actually drawn to these schools for the promise of a meal, like teenagers converging on a food court at the mall. Seafloor creatures will also gather together around sources of food. Dead animals that sink to the bottom attract groups of scavengers looking for a free meal. These tiny yellow and pink amphipods are drawn to the scent of death, amassing in droves on this whale carcass to feast on its flesh. Even animals that are attached to the bottom can be found in groups. These white branching sponges trap their prey on velcro-like spines. Clustering on prominent seafloor features keeps them bathed in the currents that swirl past, increasing the chances that their spines will snag a meal. These clams cluster in areas where the sediment contains a chemical called hydrogen sulfide. Bacteria in the clams thrive on this chemical, providing nutrients that the clams need to survive. Open ocean drifters must deal with strong currents that can transport them many miles. Current-induced groups can collect different kinds of animals together, like these baby red octopuses and a fish with its egg yolk jelly host. Delicate creatures like these sea nettles get caught up and swept together where currents collide. Fortunately for them, a rich planktonic food source also collects in the mix, and dinner is served. Krill actively swarm together to maintain a massive aggregation so thick that they blot out the lights of our underwater vehicles. This tumbling cloud of animals can confuse a predator trying to catch individuals within the swarm. Whether for protection, socializing, or foraging, sticking together is critical for the survival of many types of animals in the sea. This is Jane Lee for the Monterey Bay Aquarium Research Institute.